Now you will see why there's every day a traffic jam at Kuala Lumpur during the after the we are going break from the work uh, at Kuala Lumpur. You'll see. Traffic construction in Kuala Lumpur may trigger through urban heat island effect. This is okay. Why there is of, often traffic jam? The cause of the traffic jam are the rapid growth of the population increasing of the vehicles and narrow roads. Traffic jam is a great problem and it will kill it will kill our valuable time. Our works also are badly hampered by a, by a traffic jam. What causes Malaysia traffic congestion? Oh, okay, we'll see the analysis of the traffic flow in the major areas of Kuala Lumpur. Oh, it's a download now, man. Okay, we'll see what is the rush hour in Kuala Lumpur. Assuming you are staying at the zone all suit or along Jalampang, try to avoid avoid 11.45 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. and 4.45 p.m. to 7 p.m. Monday to Thursday. The traffic on Friday is generally heavier as some officers have longer lunch break to accumulate Muslim staff for prior, uh, fr uh, Friday prayer and the rush to get to the mosque for prayer. You know where is Jalan Empang? Jalan Empang is near the KSCC Twin Tower. That's a, that's a traffic, uh, traffic place. What causes too much traffic? Traffic construction is caused by a number of factories such as road are uh, poorly designed for or over capacity lo localized factory factors like traffic uh, like city traffic lightning patterns and even like accident and construction. It's not factory factors factors sorry. One of them for cause of traffic construction. There are four types of traffic construction are environment, mechanical, human and infrastructure related related. Okay, we'll see. Which situation creates traffic jam on the road? Oh, oh the cause. Okay. That's only thanks. We'll see in the next episode.